How's it going guys, it's your Gabe here, and today I'm bringing my first episode of my Be A Pro series. I know I've been, uh, I've been talking for a while that I'm going to do a Be A Pro series, and I finally got into it, I decided on a nice, uh, storyline, and, uh, a player that I'm going to go with, uh, and this first episode will kind of just be a backstory, and you guys will get to see the history of the player, and then... The next episode will we'll go into like the Memorial Cup, and so on and so on. So to start off, I guess I'll uh, start with the story. Hope you guys enjoy it. I'll be back right when the story ends. Mikkel Pedersen is a 19-year-old hockey player coming from his hometown of Copenhagen, Denmark. He was born to a Finnish mother and a Danish father. He lived with only his Danish father as his mother and twin brother moved back to Finland after a few weeks from when they were born. Mikkel was always a fat hockey fanatic and started playing hockey from the young age of three. As a four-year-old, he finished as a top point getter in an eight-year-old league in Denmark. After playing for the Danish national youth teams, he was signed to his first professional contract with the Helsinki Joker as a 16-year-old. He led the SM League on both goals and points in his first two years, but wasn't able to win the championship for Joker for the first time since 2002. As an 18-year-old, he was named the captain of the team and finished the season with 53 goals, 39 assists, and 92 points, all in 58 games. Going to the playoffs, Joker were ranked 4th in the regular season, and everyone wondered whether Mika would be able to lead the team to a championship. Joker ended up matching Tampier Eels in the SM Liga playoff finals, and after winning Game 1 3-0, Pedersen finished Game 2 with a 7-point game to make the series 2-0. After the games in Tampere were split, Joker was back home in Game 5 with a 3-1 series lead and a chance to bring winning back to Helsinki for the first time since 2002. With the game tied 4-4 and in overtime, Miguel Pedersen scored the title-winning shot, winning goal with a rocket shot that found the back of the net. A jubilation followed and Pedersen was able to leave Helsinki as a champion and look forward to follow his dream into the NHL. After applying for eligibility in the 2011 NHL Draft, Mikkel was rejected, even though he was projected to be the first overall draft pick. Following the news, Mikkel was approached by several KHL team, teams, offering a multi-million dollar contract to sign. Mikkel was tempted, however he decided the best way to get to the NHL would be for him to head overseas to the CHL and develop into an even better player there. He decided to sign with the Shawinigan Cataracts as he would be guaranteed a Memorial Cup spot and was hoping to show scouts that he was definitely the real deal. In Shawinigan, he helped them finish a first place finish, as well as winning MVP of the league with 89 goals, 42 assists, and 131 points, all in 68 games. He was able to lead Shawinigan to the QMJHL finals, however, they lost to St. John to the St. John Sea Dogs in seven games. With the feat in mind, Pedersen promised the Shawinigan fans that he would win the Memorial Cup in their hometown. He is six foot two, 190 pounds, with what scouts say is the best shot they've seen in the past 10 to 20 years. His idol growing up was Matt Sandin, and he always cheered for the Toronto Maple Leafs. He's a flashy player both on and off the ice. However, he does have a short temper, and if something doesn't go his way, he likes to bring others into his problems. So, I hope you guys enjoyed that uh, little backstory for the creation episode of Michael Pedersen. Uh, once again, episode 2 will have more Memorial Cup uh, we'll have the uh, mo we'll have the Memorial Cup gameplay, as well as another interesting plot that is going to be apparent throughout the career of Mikael Pedersen. And that's kind of going to be the main focus around his career. Uh, hopefully, it works out and NHL doesn't screw me over. But I think uh, the thought of it is uh, really interesting. And so, hope you guys enjoy this uh, little creation backstory kind of thing, just to get you guys pumped up. Episode two should be out maybe Wednesday or Thursday. We'll see how it goes. I don't know if I'm going to be uploading this every two days, maybe every three days, uh, just to because uh, Let's Play Hut is the main series. And I need to play eight games every two days, so it takes quite a bit of time. But anyways, hope you like this uh, little creation episode for uh, and the backstory episode for Mikael Pedersen, uh, the Danish center superstar to be. I hope you, if you have any uh, comments on how to uh, how you guys want me to approach this be a pro series. Uh, I'm all for it. I'm all ears. Send me any suggestions of what you guys want to see, how much gameplay, like how much episodes per season, that kind of stuff, you know, just to help out with to make you guys interested in it. And if you do enjoy my content, a subscribe would be great. So anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this first episode of Mikael Pedersen Be a Pro. 
And I hope you all have a great day. Peace. Follow me on Twitter for the latest updates on my videos.